Tell me. Yeah, very cute. Now quit screwing around and just tell me where you are. Even an FBI agent needs a day off. Yeah, well, you're back on the clock. I'll pick you up in 30 minutes. He's back. Who? Infinity. When? Yesterday in Brockton. How do you know it's him? The victim was branded. Same MO. All right. See you at my place. You got... So you are stuck with me. Get it, Mikira. Gordon got MVP, and I got this trophy for the most improved player. Well, you're still my MVP and my number one little man. Mom, I'm turning 10 in two days. I know. When everyone's back from school break, we're going to throw you a big party. <laughs> steal that number one trophy? person I've been looking for because I need a deputy who can ride along and help keep law and order. That's me, isn't it? Can I please this one, please? Well, what are you waiting for, deputy? You have a town to save. You're the best, Mom. Can you have him back by 7? I think we can be back by 6.59, right? Mm -hmm. Listen to Deputy Martell, okay? Uh -huh. Don't worry, he's a good kid. Hop in. And be safe. I'll be fine, Mom. He's right, you know. You worry too much. I worry just the right amount. Yeah. You better get going. He's probably pressing every button in that car. All right. See you later. Hey, Sean. Yeah. Thank you again for doing this for him. You're welcome. See ya. See ya. Tracy Scarro, 26. She left the bar at 12.40, was found dead an hour later. Same M.O. By the looks of it. Girl fits the profile. Roughly same age, same look. Strangled and branded. It's been six years. Why now? 26. Same age as my niece. Yeah, he'll slip up. They always do. Great way to solve a case. Waiting for another body. Let's check in with the sheriff first thing in the morning. You can see the relaxed and informal pose of the subject. The Sumato stylized colors, almost smoky, give it a feeling of movement, 
As if you are the one making the brush strokes. How much? Eight thousand. I'd be willing to go as high as sixty-five hundred. Um, can you just give me one moment? Sure. Thank you. What are you doing here? I brought a gift for Cody. Do you have one for every birthday you missed? You knew when you married me that I could be anywhere, covering a war, a hurricane. Hell, half the time I'm not even in the country. <sighs> when I married you? Well, I was young and dumb, but I'm here now. I've done a lot of thinking, and I realized how stupid I was. And untrustworthy and unreliable and a terrible excuse for a husband and a father. Let me think about it. I needed that scene. Sorry. Sorry? Sorry doesn't cut it, Clay. I want you to leave. I'm done leaving. Let me make it up to you. To Cody. How do you intend to... Hi, guys! 659 on the dot. Hi. Sean Martel. Clay. I'm her... My ex, and he's leaving. Hey, buddy. It's been a long time. matter can't say hi to your old man okay i think that's enough for now but i you just go and we can talk about this later later cody your old man just wants to give you a gift look ray it's clay it's time to go all right yeah okay she asked you to leave it's time to go let me know if you like it my number's inside Call any time. You okay, honey? Sorry about that, Sean. It's all right. Deputy Cody and I had a great day today, didn't we? Deputy, wow. Honorary deputy. <laughs> you can put that on my office, honey, and I'll be in in a minute. Sure, Mom. Sure you're okay? Yeah, we'll be fine. Thank you. I'll call you soon. Okay. Okay. Have a good night. Good night, deputy. <laughs> <laughs> that was a long day. How was yours? I'm oh, pretty good. Sean took Cody out on his cruiser and made him an honorary deputy for the day. Seriously? So cute. Cody, your mom just informed me that you are an honorary deputy. Yep. Look what my dad got me. Sonic boots. What? What? Uh, is that coming over later? Maybe tomorrow, honey. Hopefully never. Okay, Cody, it is time for bed. Hey. Okay. Good night, Mom. Love you. Good night. Love Bye. you. Okay, so what? Clay was here? You didn't tell me. Yeah, because I wanted to forget it happens. Well, tell me what happened. Oh. Came to the gallery cost me a sale I couldn't afford to lose. Oh, caused a scene, but luckily Sean was there. Ah, oh, your knight in shining armor. We're just friends. So, how did Cody take it? I think he was just confused. Well, that's not good either. Jeez. I never liked Clay. In high school, he was such a bully. Always listen to me. <laughs> so is Clay gonna stick around? Who knows? be better if he just disappeared again. No. Talking about disappearing, it is time for me to leave. Oh. Well, I will talk to you soon. I'll walk you out here.
What is it, honey? I think there's somebody in the house. What? I think I saw something. Okay, stay here. Through the whole house and there is no one here she must have been dreaming but i'm gonna stay with you tonight okay Ready? Yep. Let me see your game face. Oh, now come on. You can do better than that. Give me like a real... Mom, that's a pirate. <laughs> okay, they're your friends. Love you. Love you too. Huh? Amanda. How dare you come here after what you did? What I did? Clay, the photograph... Now who's acting crazy? I will get a restraining order if I have to. Yeah, it looks like you got the cops right under your thumb there. What? I don't know why you're doing this, but you need to stop. I just want to see my son. And I'd like to see him before I leave. Unbelievable. You're leaving again. It's just for a few days, Amanda. And then I'll be back for good. You can't keep Cody away from me forever. I'm not trying to keep him away from you. I'm trying to protect him from you breaking his heart again. Yo, Cody is my kid, too. This is my first time working with the FBI, actually. Well, we appreciate the assistance. Absolutely. Anything that we can do to help you out. Have you read the briefing? I have. And you believe that we have a serial killer here, huh? Mm -hmm. That's why the state sent in the FBI. So what differentiates male psycho? Well, we've developed a matrix over the past several years. Ethnicity, location, psychological. He's choosing his victims carefully. 
They're always slim, brunette, attractive. And then he brands them with a symbol. And you think that the killer could be here? It's possible. Profile describes him as Caucasian male, 30 to 40 years of age, smart, resourceful. But why here? Maybe it all started here. His obsession with the one. You mean the one that the victims look like? The one that he always wanted, but could never have. Well, first things first, let's get you set up in an office. Detective Sayers up, up the one in the back. I, uh, <clears throat> I got you something. What is it? What would I like to know. Dylan, we should get back. Hang on. Close your eyes. I got something for you. Okay. Keep on close. <laughs> there you go. Oh, my God. I love it. Beautiful. Oh, Dylan, thank you. Oh, you're the best. I'll be back, okay? What is this? I just took it. Anyone else around? No. I thought we were alone. What have we got? Girl's missing. This is the boyfriend. Hey, we found the body! Please, let's go. Please, I just... Is, is it her? In the car. Please, please tell me it's not her. Please, please. Just wait here. Please. Wait here. Keep an eye on him, It's him. Let's get forensics on this right away. The murder's different this time. It's more violent than the last. Broke her neck. The others were by asphyxiation. He's escalating. The cycle between kills is getting shorter. I think this guy's unraveling. We gotta find this guy before we have another body on our hands. Uh, okay. How's that? What are you doing? Well, talking about getting back into it, I just took a photo for your dating profile. Uh, no, no way. Yes, way. <laughs> no. What is it, terrible? Guys are gonna love it. What's that? That wasn't there before. You gotta be kidding me. What is it? That's another one of those pictures. You mean like the one Clay unnerved me, so I'll let him see Cody. I don't know, Amanda. Do you think I should call the police? Yeah, I do. Okay. Clay. <sighs> Meet FBI agents Sayers and Burton. What is the FBI doing here? Is this connected to those murders? They are here to look into the murders, but we're not jumping to any conclusions at this point. We have some questions for you, and, and there's um, a theory we're looking into. You're saying the first photo has arrived when? Thursday, and then the second one arrived tonight. Is there something else, Mrs. Jennings? No. I'm just having trouble believing Clay would be capable of something like this. You mentioned he'd been absent. For how long? Just under six years. And he left because? Difference of opinion. It's his opinion to treat me like crap, and I disagreed. 
Yeah, and I can attest to that. Well, we won't take any more of your time. Thank you very much. If there's anything else, please let us know. Yes, sure. Thank you. No, it's no doubt that's a photo of Vicky Fanning. Same bracelet and the victim was branded. Yep. The second photo also has a branding on the thigh. Tracy Squirrel. So, our killer is sending photos of his victims to Amanda. Think it's a husband? Well, I think he's a wild card, but it's possible. Seems pretty clear to me. Husband gets back and Amanda gets the first photo? Pretty big coincidence. I don't believe in coincidences. Put an APB out on Clay Jennings ASAP and keep this out of the press. All right, will do. We need to find out more about her. She doesn't know this, but she's an integral piece of this puzzle. Could be. Let's hope she fits. Yeah. For her sake, let's hope she doesn't. Hmm. I'm sorry, Mom. I didn't mean to. It's okay. Am I going to see my dad again? I don't know, honey. Maybe. Do you want to? Does he want to see me? Of course he does. He just works a lot. Do you remember what I told you? That he's a photojournalist. And what does that mean? That he's away a lot. Exactly. So we can talk about it, okay? Come on, it's time for dinner. It's a match. He took photos of Tracy and Vicky and sent them to Amanda. That's new for him. Well, let's not forget, serial killers evolve like anybody else. I think he's finally found his voice and he's trying to speak to Amanda. You think he's trying to scare her? I think he's trying to impress her. She does own an art gallery. Well, let's not forget that her ex is a photographer. And he was gone for six years. That's a long time to be MIA. Yeah, it says he was working in South America for a few years, but during the time of the initial killing, nothing. Can't find a trace of him anywhere. Any luck tracing his whereabouts? No, they're still looking for him. So... Clay and Amanda went to the same high school, right? Graduated in 98. I'm going to talk to Amanda. I'm going to find out if she knows if he's got any relatives in town. Okay. Hey, Jen? Ms. Jennings. I was hoping I could have a moment. Of course. Do you mind if I just finish one last thing? Not at all. So was this always your studio, or did you and your husband... Oh, just mine. Clay was never in town long enough to do something like this. Do you know where he's been over the last six years? No, no idea. His photography brings him all over the world. Just not usually here. So, uh, it's the first time you've seen him. Yes. I... I answered all these questions already. Is there something going on? Has Clay ever showed you any of his... personal photos? Something similar to the ones you've seen? Dead women. Um... Clay is not a, a good father, but he's not a... He, he, couldn't... he may not be involved, but we still need to talk to him. I've seen this before. Anything like that? No, not until I got the first photo. Do you have any of Clay's photos here that I can have a look at? Probably not, but I can check. Great.
This one of yours? Yeah, that's not one of my better pieces. I have been on edge since Clay got back, so it's been more stress than inspiration. Well, I've seen worse ways to deal with stress, trust me. <laughs> you must be married. <laughs> no, I've never been married. I seem to always let work get in the way of any relationship. Someone? Maybe. How about you? Are you in a relationship? I mean, uh, is there someone that we should know about? No. Are you asking me personally or professionally? Um. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just relieving the stress with the joke. I could not find any of Clay's photos. Thanks for your time. Absolutely. There's one more thing. Any of Clay's family in town, or do you know any friends or relatives he could be staying with? No. He doesn't have any family here. I don't know about his friends. I'm not part of his life anymore. Sorry. Well, if anything comes up, please don't hesitate to give me a call. I, I will, Agent. Thank you. Call me Craig. Thank you, Craig. Cody's been quiet, just hanging in his room. He hasn't been himself lately. Did he eat dinner? Well, I called him down, but no response. Guess he's not hungry. Could you check on him for me? Yeah, sure. Hold on a sec. Cody! Mom's on the phone. Cody! He's not answering. I'll go check. Thanks. Cody! Cody? Haley, what's going on? Cody! He's not here. He's not in his room. Call, call the police. I'll be right there. I'm... It was him. It was Clay. I know he took my son. We're looking for him. We've issued an Amber Alert, and we are doing everything that we can. Are you certain that Cody didn't just run away? No. No, he wouldn't do that. Amanda, I know these questions are hard to answer, but we have to ask you these questions. Cody didn't run away. Betty came back to reestablish a relationship with his son. God, if anything happens to Cody. Amanda, the Amber Alert has been issued. We're doing everything we can. Just one second. Can, can we have a moment, please? Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. My son is missing. I know. I, I, I I'm meant... sorry. I'm sorry. I know you're just trying to help. We're going to find him. I promise. We're done here. Thank you. Thank you. I'll see you at the station. Yeah, see ya. What the hell was that all about? What? You cozying up to her. Is there something I should know? I'm just trying to work the case like you. Seems to me you're getting a little too close. All right, quit trying to play therapist. Look, the killer is sending her photos. Whether Clay is involved or not, she's the key to all this. The closer I get to her, the closer I get to him. You sure there's nothing else? Yeah. All right.
What's going on? I just, I didn't know what else to do. I'm going crazy at home. Amanda, we are doing everything we can to try to help bring your son back safely. You should be there right now in case he shows up or he calls. Okay, you're right. Um, if you hear anything at all. I will. Okay, thank you. I will. Please, please, just find my son. Before I go, thank you. Agent, I need to speak with you. Of course, come in. Look who's here. I came to tell you you can call off the Amber Alert. Cody's fine. He's with his father. You were right. He ran away. Did he tell you where he was? He's with Clay on a photo shoot. So you, you can call off the search. I would seriously advise against that. Clay didn't do anything wrong. He's Cody's father. And if I don't press any charges, there's no crime, right? What about after the death of each of those women? If Clay had anything to do with those photos, your son could be with a murderer. Clay is a lot of things, but he's not a murderer. He just wants to see his son. I'm sorry we wasted your time. Just give me a second, I'll be right back. Amanda, I'm happy they found your son. I'm glad he's okay, but we still have a killer out there. I've given you the photos. There's nothing else I can do. Well, you can tell us where Clay is. So you can arrest him for something he didn't do in front of my son? Have you ever heard of obstruction of justice? My son is more important than your case.
any info? No. She's protecting him. She's thinking about what's best for her son. We have to think about what's best for the case. We have to explore other leads. Yeah. Hello? Do they believe you? I think so. For Cody's sake, I hope so. Go to your gallery. By the front door, you'll find a gift that I left you. Can I, can I please speak to Cody? I'll be in touch. Nice turn on, Amanda. So how are Clay and Cody getting along? I spoke to him this morning. He's having a great time with his dad. Really? What are they doing? Agent? Hi, Amanda. Can you excuse us for a moment? What's going on? What are you doing here? Oh, I didn't know it was a private showing. It's not. I... I just need this to go smoothly. I just had some more questions for you. When was the last time you spoke to your ex? You would know you have access to my phone records. No, I don't. Not since he called off the search. Please don't do this here. Amanda, why are you protecting him? Did he scare you? Did he say not to say anything? Is that it? This is harassment. You know that? You know that, right? What, what you're doing here? Harassment? Well, what am I doing? Clearly you're not doing your job because you're focused on I have my job to do, so you need to leave. Amanda, next time you talk to Clay, tell him to come to the station and answer some questions. I hope you know what you're doing. What is that supposed to mean? The agent. He's trying to help you. Okay? If you know anything, you need to tell them where Clay is. He took Cody without your permission. That is kidnapping. Clay is Cody's father. Why are you protecting him? The only one I'm protecting is my son. Amanda, if you know something, you need to tell the police. Please just stay out of this. What are you hiding? I'm not hiding anything. Amanda, I know you. There's something you're not telling me. Please, don't push me on this. How are you acting? Putting on this exhibit, protecting Clay. Come on. It's like you don't even care about Cody. I love my son. And you more than anybody should know that. I'm sorry, okay? I, I didn't mean it like that. I just mean that you are acting strange. I think maybe it's best that I go. Yes, can you let Agent Sayers know I've just spotted Clay Jennings heading south on Mission Street. Plate number C2D4B11. Thanks.
what's going on. What what are you arresting me for? Where's Cody? I don't know, with his mom. Don't lie to us. Where's your son? What do you mean? Where's Cody? What happened to my son? Take him inside. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer. This is all yours. I just want to let you know this conversation is being recorded. Do you know why you're here, Clay? Did something happen to Cody? Why don't you tell us? I don't know what we're talking about. He should be with Amanda. Don't lay that crap on us. We know you took the kid. What? Okay, now you're scaring me. Where's my son? Amanda said you took him out of his bedroom a few nights ago. So why don't you tell me? Where is your son? She's lying. I, I don't have Cody. I don't have Cody. I, I swear, she's making it up. Why would she do that? Listen, I've made a lot of mistakes in my life. But losing her and not being with my son are the biggest. Now, I've come back, and I am trying to make amends. But she's made it pretty clear that she doesn't want me in Cody's life. So if I had to take a guess, I would say that she's... Hiding him till I leave. Hiding him. <laughs> That's an interesting theory. Look, you can check. I've been on assignment in Moab. There are plenty of witnesses who can testify to that. Go ahead and write it down. Happily. So are you going to charge her? Charge who? Amanda. You're the only person in our sights right now. So you better hope your story checks out. for my lawyer now. We'll look at it later. Thanks. So what do you think? I don't know. You know. I don't have that gut feeling he's our guy. So we keep him on ice until we can check out his alibi. Then we can ask him about the murders. We got him for 48 hours. All right. Well, he can cool his heels and cells overnight, and then uh, we'll start in the morning. Sounds good. All right. Have a good night. Good night. Night. Amanda. We arrested Clay. Where's Cody? He claims he just got back from Utah. Cody wasn't with him. He has to be. Clay says you're lying. He's accusing you of setting him up. He says you know exactly where Cody is. Obviously he's lying. I want to believe you, but... Find my son. How did it go? One of them is lying. I just don't know which one. Things are moving along very nicely, aren't they? They arrested Clay. I know. I didn't know about it, I, I swear to you. An unfortunate circumstance, but we can improvise. Cody, okay. So what is this? What is this? Remember, Amanda, this is for you. the door. I'm, I'm going to lock the door. I... 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 Really? Did you hear me? I...
Same MO as the others. Strangled, branded. She doesn't look like the others, though. That's for sure. It wasn't Clay, unless he'd be in two places at the same time. Plus, his alibi checks out. We're gonna have to let him go. I know. We're running out of options. Why don't you finish up here? I'll take her home. Are you sure you want to stay here? We can put you up in a hotel. I should be here in case Cody... I can't believe this is happening. Do you know anyone that would want to hurt Haley? We know it's not Clay. You can't keep me in the dark here. You got to be honest with me. I just want to find my son. We will. Amanda, I can stay. You shouldn't. Right. I shouldn't. Have a good night. Next time, you better make sure you got the right guy. Locked in a small town. People notice when you slip up. Don't go anywhere. Might have some questions for you. No, I'm not going anywhere until my son turns up. If I find out you had anything to do with his disappearance, you're done. You're looking in the wrong direction, pal. Hey, Clay, let me just give you some advice. Stay away from Amanda. Cody, let me speak to him. Where is my son? Please. He's fine. You just do everything I say, and he'll be fine. You're my muse, Amanda. Why did you do it? Why, Haley? She got in the way. She was my best friend. Really? You hated her for letting your son get taken. You don't know what I feel. Oh, I know everything about you. Stop! We've only just begun. No, no. No, please. I am begging you. I need to be to my son. Be ready in five minutes. I need you to be strong and brave for Mama, okay? No, we'll have you home soon, I promise. Enough with the family reunion. No! Mom! Cody, I love you! I'll be in touch. No, no.
I'll be in touch. here I called a few times and you didn't pick up so I thought I just need some time to myself well uh call me if you need anything No, no, he just came by. I, did, I didn't know anything about it. You have to believe me. Why should I believe you? Because I saw the shrine. I know that everything you're doing has been for me. Nobody's ever done that before. Not my husband. Nobody. I, I realize that now. Do you? Yes, I do. And I won't let anybody come between us, not... Have a bond, Amanda. Yes, we do. We do have a bond, and that's... That's why I know that you would never hurt Cody. Because he's a piece of me. So please, I just... I need to see him. Please. Soon. No more cops, Amanda. No more cops. What's going on? Why are you lying to the police? I, 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 I... Where is Cody? You can't get involved. Don't get involved? He's my son. I don't have him. What are you talking about? If you don't have him, where... And where is he? Someone took, took him. Who? Do you know who has him? Have you talked? He said he would hurt him. Emma, you can't do this alone. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. He's the one who should be scared. Tell me who the bastard is. I didn't call the police because he said he... He said he would kill Cody. We have to tell the FBI. They can help no, us. No, you can't tell anyone. Clay, swear to me you won't tell anyone. Swear to me. He said he would kill our son. I swear. You should go. He's, he's, he's always watching me. You have to go. Emma. 
trust me. I will find our son. time. I'm gonna wait in half an hour. his victims anymore. He's killing the people around her. He's sending her a message. What's that? He loves her. We're missing something. Based on blood spatter, the shooter was standing over there. His MO is changing. He's never killed anyone like this before. It's always been up close and personal. He's starting to feel the heat. What about the missing kid? God, this case is getting worse by the second. One of the two of them is lying. My money's on the wife. Yeah. I think we caught a break. We had a security cam. We just gotta get the footage. I'm on it. to talk to you it's about Clay. What's going on? I'm really sorry to tell you this, but we found Clay last night. Clay's dead, Amanda. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What, what, what happened? We don't know. Not yet. But it looks like he crossed the wrong people. I know this is horrible news. But, Amanda, I need you to focus because we need to find Cody. If you know where he is, any idea at all. I know a really good lawyer. I don't think anyone can help me. I can. I've always been there for you, Amanda. You can trust me. Always, you know that. Cody's... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's all right. It's all right. Let me get you a glass of water. Sean. I'm sorry. I just... I think I need to be alone. Understandable. Yeah. We'll be okay. Thank you for 
not being here for me. acting, it seems like he's waiting for someone. That's our killer. Hang on right there. Back up. Zoom in. He's the infinity killer. Clay must have been getting too close. What are you doing here? Where is my son? I have always loved this place. We used to come out here in high school all the time. Do you remember that? I remember. I know who you are, Eric. Not anymore. Although I'm surprised that you remember the name Eric Hansen. Because you wouldn't give me the time of day. Oh, come on. You can stop playing the games. You barely knew I even existed. I know that time can change a person. But the real reason that you didn't put together that I was Eric Hansen is because you don't remember Eric Hansen. See? 
Sayers is going to figure out it was you. No, Sayers. Sayers? He's going to get what's coming to him. We'll talk about that later. Come on. I want to show you something. Would you please call me back? Where are you? Amanda? Amanda? It's Martel. What? What do you mean, Martel? Martel. He's our serial killer. He's Infinity. I think she's gone after him. Gone where? I don't know. I'm working on that. See if you could track him down on your end. Don't let on that he's a suspect. I'm on it. You can fool me. saw something he shouldn't have. I couldn't just let him go. Please, Sean. 
I just need to see him. Patience. Please. You and I never really had a chance as Eric and Amanda, did we? No, we didn't. Hmm. I have waited for this for a long, long time. There were others. But no one is you. Haley got in the way. And Clay knew too much. He never appreciated you. I wish we had spent more time together back then. It seemed like we had a lot in common. Both have a very unique eye. We see the world differently. Everything you sent me was beautiful. I tried to get over you. I tried. passed away and they left a lot of money so I came home and I became Sean Martell the perfect cover we always used to hang out right here do you remember that of course I do why did you never notice me I did. Liar! I'm sorry. <laughs> I was just so in love with you. I used to watch you and Clay here. It made me burn inside. That was a long time ago. Yeah. This is where it all began. I just my woman I thought of, the only woman I dreamed of. I couldn't get you out of my mind. Is there still time for us? We could be a family. We could be a family. I just, I need to see Cody. If you take me to Cody, I will. I'll do anything you want. I'll go anywhere you want. I'll be anyone you want. Isn't this beautiful? And right now, I decide who you will be, where you will go, and whether you ever see your son again. Love is beautiful. This isn't, this isn't love. You're crazy. Crazy to love you. Ah! <laughs> 
Perfect, Amanda. But you had to lie. Like all the other women I killed. You're a lying bitch. I gave you everything. And you gave me nothing. Martell! Don't do it! You're too late, Sayers! Leonardo da Vinci, how much longer? I'm starting to get a cramp. I'm with Craig. I don't know how much I can hold this pose. It's almost done. All right. Mom, you can't move. Oh, sorry. Oh. Now I'm going to start us all over again. No, no, no. no. no, no don't do that. Just hang on a second. Uh, you know, I have something for you. Come on over here. I'm going to make it up to you, all right? Now, I know how much you like soccer, so we're going to fly all the way to Los Angeles to watch the Timbers play the Galaxy. you, and so do I. <laughs> oh. It's a burden. Okay, a new case, and that I'd check in to see if I can entice you to come back to the agency. Not a chance. But I'll tell you what, Burton, whenever you're in town, you're more than welcome to stop by. I'll see you around, Sayers. Later, Burton. Bye, Burton. <laughs> Where were we? 